Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 11.09 a.m., and it's Thursday, June 2nd, 2022. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing another one of these interesting Odyssey Mushroom Elixir Energy Drinks. I got this at the Aikens Natural Market in Bixby. It's a little bit expensive. It was like $3.80 for one can, but it was on sale for $3, so I got a little bit cheaper, but, um, yeah, it's normally almost $4 for one can, but with the tax a little bit over $4, you know what I mean, around four twenty. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Dragon Fruit Lemonade Odyssey Mushroom Elixir Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Really cool looking can, you know, just saying. So, yeah. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Anyway, it's silver top with the silver tab. Bombs the best fighting production code. Best Buy, um, I'm gonna wipe it off, a little bit dirty, October 21st, 2022, so it's still fresh for a little while, it's on a labeled can, um, this one, the one I reviewed in my last review was like, a, more of like a smoother plastic, but um, the one I'm reviewing in my next review is more like a matte plastic, Almost like not as shiny and like feels a little bit different. Doesn't feel as smooth, you know. Um, a little bit rougher, you know. But um, anyway, this one's a sparkling mushroom elixir, Odyssey mushroom elixir, energy plus focus, sparkling dragon fruit lemonade. Has cordyceps and lion's maiden mushrooms. 2,500 milligrams of mushrooms, 12 ounces, 355 milliliters. It's like a supernova like galaxy sort of design. It has like stars and stuff. It's like in space. It's like sacred geometry, you know. Like a spiritual energy drink. Very interesting, you know, can or label anyway. Um, so yeah. Cordyceps 10 to 1, 1,250 milligrams. Lines main 8 to 1, 1,250 milligrams. Caffeine 85 milligrams. For your mind, Odyssey sparkling elixirs were crafted to enhance your energy plus focus by utilizing highly concentrated aptogenic mushrooms. To elevate your day, our elixirs embody the sacred geometric shape of Metatron's cube, which is used to activate positive thoughts, allowing you to harness your own personal power to do good. It elevates energy, focus, and clarity, supports wellness for the spirit, body, and mind. It contains active beta glucans. The dragon fruit lemonade flavor combines tropical tones with a delicate tartness to create an exotic flavor fusion that is refreshing and unique. Get connected to odysseyelixir.com at Odyssey Elixir. It has Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook logos. It has SKU, the recycling logo. Please recycle. Um, some other codes and 10% juice. Nutrition pack starting size 1 can, 355 milliliters, amount per 7 calories 20. Total fat 0 grams, 0%, saturated fat 0 grams, 0%, trans fat 0 grams. Cholesterol 0 milligrams, 0%, sodium 0 milligrams, 0%, total carbohydrate 16 grams, 6%. Dietary fiber 0 grams, 0%, total sugars 2 grams. Food 0 grams, added sugar 0%, protein 0 grams. Vitamin D 0 micrograms, 0%, calcium 2 milligrams, 0%, iron 0 milligrams, 0%. Potassium 42 milligrams, 0%. Vitamin C 8 milligrams, 8%. Then it has other ingredients filtered carbonated water, organic erythritol, dragon fruit puree, organic lemon juice concentrate, natural flavor monk fruit juice concentrate, organic lion's mane, mushroom extract, organic cordyceps mushroom extract, panax ginseng root extract, l theanine organic caffeine from green tea extract, distributed by Odyssey Wellness LLC, Fort Lauderdale, Florida 33309. It's vegan, has a U in the circle. The non GMO, no preservatives. So, yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. So, I'll let you see it right quick. I already showed you the top and the bottom, but I'm um, anyway. Very colorful can with the pink and the yellow. I'm gonna bite in like the orange a little bit. Yeah, dragon fruit lemonade. This one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. Um, the last one had a little bit of a weird taste, though. Um, reminding me of like um, Guayusa drinks a little bit. I wanted to mention that. Like those old Runa drinks that I reviewed. Had like a little bit like an herbaly tea sort of taste a little bit too. Um, but yeah, it had the monk fruit juice concentrate, so it tasted similar to like the um, Yerba Mate Guru I reviewed recently. The one I reviewed yesterday. Um, it was like a another like sort of passion fruit flavor. This passion fruit orange guava. But um, 
Yeah, the guru, the yerba mate was like a passion fruit, but with like the monk fruit juice. So it was a little bit similar to that. So this one might be a little bit similar too. I don't know. This dragon fruit lemonade. But I mean, anyway, that's pretty much the entire can. So I'll let you see it up closer right quick. So hold on a minute. Okay, I off the can. I'm going to shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it. And the color looks the same as the one I reviewed yesterday. A little bit like a mostly clear color, but it has a little bit of like a golden tint, though. Definitely a little bit bubbly and carbonated. Actually, um, the one I reviewed yesterday was actually really smooth. It wasn't really too carbonated, even though it looks carbonated. Um, so yeah, the, the look of it um, reminds me of like the X2 energy drinks that were discontinued from Subway. Just wanted to mention that too. Um, that's what also the texture, like the when I drink it, is also like that though. It also reminded me of that. Because um, the um, X2 energy drinks from Subway had a little bit of like tea in them. But um, this doesn't have any tea though. But um, anyway, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely a sweet lemonade scent. I don't really like lemonade drinks too much, but this one smells actually pretty good. Especially mixed with like the dragon fruit. Definitely like a tropical sweet citrusy smell. Um, I think this one actually smells better than the one I reviewed yesterday. This one might be better too, we shall see. Um, I think it might be. Just going off the smell of it anyway. Definitely smells like a clean, um, fruity smell. Um, definitely reminds me a little bit of like the pink lemonade monster rehab um, without the tea part of it though it smells a little bit like that like a little bit like a pink lemonade even though this is like a dragon fruit lemonade and still like a strawberry lemonade but um it still smells actually pretty similar though see what I mean um, but yeah it smells pretty good though definitely really fruity but um, anyway, I'm anyway I'm gonna try it so here goes Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And yep. I like this one better than the one I reviewed yesterday. Um, the one I reviewed yesterday had a little bit of like a weird taste. I don't know if it's because, um, it had a little bit like a natural, like, um, earthy, like, brewed tea sort of taste a little bit too. Um, but this has that maybe a teeny bit, but, um... This one, like the passion fruit lemonade flavor, like overpowers it a lot, though. See what I mean? Also, the one I reviewed yesterday had a little bit of like that low calorie sort of like aftertaste, but um, this one is a little bit noticeable, but I'm um, not too noticeable like the one I reviewed yesterday had. See what I mean? Sweet, earthy, and tart at the same time. Um, but yeah, the flavor of this one, it's actually really good. I don't know if it's also called the mushrooms in it, um, the, in the one I reviewed yesterday or not. Might have been because of that too, but um, this one, I can't taste it, so you know what I mean? But um, yeah, these mushrooms aren't the kind of mushrooms that, you know, get you high, you know, just saying. These aren't like the cy cybolimonum, or I can't remember what they're called. Um, Silibin or something like that, but um, those mushrooms are the ones that get you high, but um, these ones don't, see so you know what I mean? These ones help you, um... I don't know, get a little bit more, less stressed, I think. Um, these are like aptogenic mushrooms, which are like the CBD is like aptogenic, so it's sort of similar to that, I think, but um, not really for sure though, but um, this doesn't have any CBD in it though, see what I mean? But um, so a really good flavorful fruity drink. A little bit healthy tasting, but um, not too much though. Um, 
the dragon fruit lemonade, you know, it actually overpowers that earthy taste quite a bit, see what I mean? But um, it's still noticeable a little bit though. Um, but yeah, it has a really cool can design. I like the look of it, I like the colors of it and stuff. Energy wise, it has 85 milligrams caffeine, it doesn't have any B vitamins or anything. So let's say energy wise, maybe lasts about an hour to about two and a half hours of energy at the most. The one I reviewed yesterday, it definitely made me more alert, but um, uh, I think I felt the same like energy wise though. I was just more alert. So this one might be about the same to me anyway, but um, we shall see. Um, but yeah, was, I guess it was okay price uh, when it was on sale though, but um, yeah, definitely expensive for one can though when it wasn't on sale, almost four dollars for one can. So I think it should be cheaper. Um, energy wise it works okay, could be stronger. Um, but the taste is actually pretty good, but um, yeah, it does have a little bit of that earthy taste, but um, it's not too noticeable on this one, so what I mean. Definitely a little tart though, but also sweet at the same time. Um, but yeah, it's actually a really good drink. I definitely like this one, better than the one I reviewed yesterday. Definitely highly recommend this one. Anyway, I'm going to give the Dragon Fruit Lemonade Odyssey Mushroom Elixir Energy Drink. You know what? I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah. Also, it definitely reminds me of like the Pink Lemonade Monster Rehab or the Strawberry Lemonade one. Watch, it's called now though. The old design was Pink Lemonade, but now it's just Strawberry Lemonade. See what I mean? But um, anyway, um, reminds me of that a little bit. Um, but yes, yeah, more of a tropical flavor though because you know it's dragon fruit instead of like strawberry um but yeah it's still pretty good though energy wise it works okay as it could have been cheaper as a cool can design but yeah i definitely like this one definitely trying to give it a 9 out of 10 so oh yeah boys it's lit so oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah i'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 oh yeah my next two reviews are gonna be two more of these odyssey mushroom elixir energy drinks stay tuned for those reviews so we're not gonna review some more videos since we're watching see you guys later peace out and bye